welcome to the U-Draw Challenge. If you've made it to this part, you may come grab one of these pieces, and then your job is to make an exact replica of it using SketchUp for Schools. You will find rulers right here. There are rulers like this with millimeters and centimeters, rulers like this with millimeters and centimeters. If you can't find one, let me know. I'm gonna just grab this one to show you quickly. So here my building is 60 millimeters by 40 millimeters. So you're gonna to have to switch to the millimeter template, which I'll show you in a second. And then you have to build an exact replica, including, see how my walls are two millimeters thick? Your walls need to be two millimeters thick. As you do the rest of your measurements though, if it looks like 29 instead of 30, Understand that I used easy numbers like 30. Don't uh, do anything that's not a 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, or 30. So at this point, let me show you in SketchUp how you show the dimensions to prove your stuff is perfect. Step one is to click on the hamburger menu and we must switch to the millimeter measurement because remember our real project is made in millimeters. As usual, we need to delete the gentleman that's in the middle and then most of your shapes will have a rectangle whatever shape it is you need to make the exact dimensions that you measured so you click the rectangle and you click the origin and I'm gonna type the 60 comma 40 for the shape that mine was remember it'll be tiny so I'm gonna use the very cool fit view to extents so I can see my shape and then this is how you prove all of your dimensioning click the dimension tool click your dimension, click the first corner, the second corner, and pull it towards you so you can label that measurement. When you click, it'll put it there permanently. I also want you to label this side. Just so you know, you've got to start at a new spot. If you try and start here, it'll edit this. So I'm gonna prove that measurement is 60 by 40, and I click to make it permanent out there as well. I'm gonna also remind you about the offset switch to your offset tool and do your walls of whatever shape you're doing remember mine was two millimeters so i'm going to click and make it wiggly type the number two and press enter and then i want to delete the middle because all of our shapes had the middles gone as well so that is how you make your design once you get started hit save because you do need to show me this and this would be your you draw challenge with your initials have fun building. Make sure yours is extremely authentic. Store it in your SketchUp folder. I hope you have fun doing this awesome lesson. If you create something epic, make sure you share it with us at HL Mod Tech. If you find this lesson useful, I'd love to have you click that like button. If you haven't subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. And if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new movie from me, HL Mod Tech, click that notification bell. If you got a question or a comment, leave it down below. Thanks for watching, friends.